Hello guys, Mano from Geekception here and hope you are doing awesome today. Now today I shall be unboxing the Zenfone 4 Max Pro. Let's begin. And welcome back guys. Now this is the Zenfone 4 uh, Max Pro, the you know natural evolution to last year's uh, Zenfone 3 Max. Uh, a huge shout out to the folks over at ASUS for actually sending this over, uh, Steven, Tang, Joe. Thank you very much. Now let's get started with the front of the box. And the first thing I can see is uh, Zenfone 4 Max with a Pro Edition uh, sticker on the front there to denote that this is a Pro version. Going on to the back of the box, I can see some more specifications. On opening up the box, I find a compartment that contains a user a guide, uh, a SIM tray ejector tool, as well as a TPU case to protect the phone. Now next up underneath is the warranty card as well as the phone itself. Now in the box is also a USB cable, a micro USB cable in this case, no USB-C, an OTG cable because yes this phone supports uh, supplying power, uh, earphones as well as extra ear tips and finally a charger. Now taking a quick tour of the device, it has a 5.5 inch 720p display, uh, up top is a 60 megapixel selfie camera as well as front face flash. Now on the bottom is a home button that does not actually have an actual click but it is also a fingerprint scanner flanked by two capacitive buttons. Now on the right side are the volume and power buttons. Uh, going on to the left side is a sim card slot. Uh, up top is a 3.5mm uh, audio jack as well as a microphone. Down below is a micro USB port flanked by a speaker and another microphone. Now around back is a dual 16 megapixel camera with dual tone flash uh, to the right of the camera there. Now that's basically been it for specifications and something I felt out away is the fact that uh, the Zenfone 4 Max is very very chunky, it feels very very heavy in the hand. Now the specifications here include a 5.5 inch uh, HD display, a downgrade from uh, last year's Zenfone 3 Max. Uh, it has 3 gigabytes of RAM, a 5000 milliampere battery, Snapdragon 430, as well as 32 gigabytes of storage. Now even though this is in the Zenfone 4 product line, it actually runs uh, Zen UI 3, which is rather interesting. Camera wise, it is packing dual 16 megapixel cameras. Uh, one is a standard camera, while the other is a wide angle camera. Now like what is now the trend? The second camera is not actually a telephoto camera. It's a wide camera that enables you to shoot wider without actually uh, having to move uh, backwards. Now both of these cameras max out at 1080p for video recording. Now moving on to the front camera and the inclusion of a flash here is nice alongside uh, the 16 megapixel up front there. Now the Zenfone 4 Max line has been known for its battery life and uh, while I do not like the you know reduction of the full HD display to HD in this one, it should actually help with battery life. It doesn't mean I still like it though. So that's something I would say the minor niggle I have with this phone. As regards the price, here in Malaysia it retails for 929 Malaysian Ringgit with on-screen conversions uh, on screen right now, hopefully on screen, on screen three times as I've said it now. Anyways, that's basically been it for this video. I hope you really enjoyed this video. Uh, what videos you want me to see uh, about the Zenfone 4 Max Pro? Let it leave a comment down there below. I've also got a request to compare the Max Pro uh, to the uh, Mi A1 from Xiaomi, which shall be coming soon. But I had to unbox this uh, phone first. So what other videos do you like? Uh, would you like gaming tests? What games would you like me to test and other stuff? Please let me know in the comments down there below. And that's basically been it for this video. I hope you have enjoyed it. I hope you know it's been able to help you on some level. If you have any questions, leave it in the comment down there below. If you like this video, give it a big fat thumbs up. It helps me out. I like it. Thumbs down if there's anything you do not like. And most importantly, don't forget to be awesome. I shall catch you lovely and take care of yourself, please. Make sure you take care of yourself. That, that's actually the most important thing. <laughs> Apart from that, don't forget to take care of yourself. I shall catch you lovely, awesome, amazing person next time. Don't forget to be awesome. Bye.